Hello guys, real girl and army girl here. Let's uh, try out a see birdie. 1873 and 45 Colt with a five, I think it's a five and a half inch barrel on it. Uh, training Don, the leader and founder of All Things Cowboy on Facebook my 1860 uh, C. Mason conversion the C. Mason conversion was beautiful but it hurt my, my wrist every time I shot it so we made a trade for this and a high dollar knife when he was here and I'm gonna shoot the target is 10 yards away. I'm shooting just regular store bought 200 grain um, cowboy loads. I'm just going to see how it shoots. If I like it, I may keep it. If not, I may trade it for something else that I want. Main thing I want to see if it's going to hurt my wrist. And um, before I get started, I'm just going to tell you guys that I'm going to take about a three month break from YouTube. I got a lot of ideas that I want to do and stuff, but I got to set up my shooting range for one thing better than what it is right now for some of the things that I want to do. Plus, I got some neighbors that live right through here, and they got kids, and they're everywhere, so I want to pick like a dirt bank back here or something for a better bullet stop. But also, not to worry anybody or concern anyone, but my health has not been doing the best in the world when putting Cody, putting a rod last Friday I had a really bad spell I won't go into detail about it and I haven't felt too good since I didn't even feel like going out and burning powder with him and Don and I realized also from a couple of pictures we took that I do need to lose some weight if the camera is working right now when I do it take pictures on my phone I don't look that big and I don't use no filters but I looked about twice the size on Don's phone when he took pictures so I'm going to try to get myself back healthy before I start shooting again so I hope you enjoy this video this is probably going to be the last one for about three or four months Oh yeah, this model, it's a newer model, 1873, Don just aged it, made it look aged. You can actually load six in this one instead of the traditional five. I think I shot high. more potent than others. This is a mixture. I just noticed that. But I'm getting a fairly good group. I don't know how to pause this phone every day, so I'm just going to set it down and reload it real quick. Forgive me for that.
So I think the harder recalling ones might have been some Don had loaded in it. These 200 grainers I put in it this morning are not so bad. I like them. <laughs> Took out the bullseye that time. Can see how we done on the ten shot real quick. Actually got quite a few in the bulls though. Looks like multiple hits. There, one there, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I'm shooting to the right with it, which is my own fault. After I started getting a grip on it, I started walking it over. Don't load it up one more time, guys. I know it's a long video, but like I said, it's probably only the last one for a little while. I only got three shots left. I thought that I'd brought more with me. Oh well, I don't need to overdo it. It's starting to feel a little dizzy again. See if I put any more close to the bulls on. Oh yeah. <laughs> one, two, three. I think that one was in there earlier. A one, two. There might be two in this one. It's a little bit bigger. I'll say two and three because it's a little wider than the others. So yeah, I shouldn't be back in a few months. I just, I got to exercise and stuff and get myself back healthy. This occipital neuralgia has been ruining me. Um, Don, I like this gun with lighter loads. And it's even with lighter loads, you, you could take Mississippi whitetail deer, take a two-legged critter, or a stray dog that's trying to attack you, so I may keep it and work with the siding a little bit. This is the Ring Girl Army Girl, over and out. Love you guys.